Hello and welcome to this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 24 February 2023. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly senior deputy editor Natasha Oudendahl writes that telecommunications companies are feeling the pressure of sustained levels of load shedding. As South Africa's persistent load shedding shows no signs of abating, the country's telecommunications companies are having to ramp up mitigation measures in an effort to keep consumers connected. The engineering news features focus on industrial and commercial lighting, where solar fittings illuminate load shedding shadows and rubber products and recycling, where a partnership aims to benefit the rubber recycling industry. The Mining Weekly features focus on South Africa's mining outlook, where the foundation is being laid for a renewed interest in exploration. And Mining in Namibia, where uranium demand is growing on the back of the Paris Agreement. This week's business leader is Pule Motibe, the incoming CEO of Ensika Consulting. And as this week's cartoon shows, it's far from clear what good will come from the decision to declare South Africa's long-running electricity crisis a state of disaster. We hope you enjoyed this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time.